both came for techs and they both passed their technicians. So congratulations again. Okay, old business. We talked about um, the Oklahoma City Memorial Marathon and registration is open. And the engaged tower climber was that with the tech report? That's Matt Garcia. Okay, uh, property inventory. To explain the sound of all, hang on on that. Property inventory, we're gonna do that right after the meeting. We'll meet over at my house. Do, do, you, do you realize it's 26 degrees out at the moment? That means that the inventory will go very fast. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, we could delay it till a warmer day. Yeah, I mean, it's 27 or 28 maybe. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Done. We, we've got a motion. And okay, next. Um, <laughs> On the Wickline access upgrades, I know this doesn't really impact us directly. One of the reasons you're hearing that through the speakers is because we're installing and upgrading an intercom system within the building as part of a, a security and safety grant. Apparently, somehow, KOMA or whoever it is has gotten into that, so I'll have to pass that along to our people. Um, we have implemented a new access system. We have magnetic locks on the portal doors so that you come through. If the doors are locked and you come here during the day, there is a little, looks like a super uh, ring button on uh, steroids. You push that, someone inside will answer. They can see you and they can hear you. So watch what you say. And they can uh, admit you to the building. We're gonna get Steve a key card so he can access the building. That way, if I'm not available, at least Steve will be able to get in the building for VE testing. If need be, we can pass one along to you along with the alarm code. But that's part of the um, access and uh, alarm safety uh, upgrades that we've done in, this, uh, in the building. It's all part of a grant through the department. Department of Homeland Security. Also, ham holiday pre-registration is open. Right now, the pre-registration prize is a Buddy Pole Buddy Stick Pro I want that. packaging. Nice portable antenna. I want it. Also, in the last 36, 48 hours, a word came out about Senate Bill 3690. And this is the bill that has been introduced that will <coughs> essentially give uh, amateur radio antennas protection from HOAs. Don't run out, and if you live in an HOA, don't run out and buy an antenna and put it up yet. This bill has been just been introduced. It's been assigned to the Transportation and Commerce Committee. That is good, because that is the committee that oversees the Federal Communications Commission. If they had tabled it or assigned it to the Paper Clips and Toothpick Committee, we would have been toast. The two people that are, the two senators that are sponsoring it, Senator Weicker from, a uh, Republican from Mississippi, and Senator Blumenthal, a Democrat from Connecticut, are the ones that have co-written this bill. Bipartisan support by two very senior senators. So it looks like it would probably have pretty good chances of getting through. A similar bill a couple of years ago was passed in the House. I think it was virtually unanimous when they passed it. When it got to the Senate, uh, Senator Bill Nelson of Florida, Democrat, sat on it because he was very closely tied to the National Homeowners Association organization. And it never got heard in the Senate. The advantage now is it's being initiated in the Senate and then it will go to the House. It's probably going to be six months to a year before we see this thing finalized. Um, keep in mind what happens later this year, an election. And that could kind of gum the works up for this moving through. But uh, it's very straightforward. Uh, I've sent a PDF copy out to the OCAPA membership. Take a look at it. There is one section of antennas that do not require pre-approval. 
and that's a, a one meter dish, a flight pole antenna, an unobtrusive wire antenna, and a vertical. I would not be surprised to see that section eliminated. Uh, but other than that, the rest of it pretty much uh, requires the HOA to comment, make reasonable accommodation of antennas. Any questions about 3690? Okay, I've got stuff to give away. I, yes. Uh, on the property inventory, remember, we had several people on the net last night that wanted to volunteer. So if you pick a day, put that out as a memo because I'm, those guys really wanted to volunteer. Yeah, okay. 